My name is Alison Canavan and I'm delighted to be hosting this event for Energia today. So we're really bringing together some fantastic ideas of how to live more sustainably and more energy efficient. It's going to be a great day. I'm really excited. Now I'm going to be looking at interior design and specifically what's going to be happening in the next year or two. So everything from the latest panelling that you can put into any type of space through to lighting and then tips how to completely alter the shape and feel of your room by not actually having to build an extension, which is clever interior design. This is the trick if you want to go with a trend for a year but don't want to spend money on the yellow sofa or a yellow sprayed uh, bookshelf but you do want to go for a trend, it's very easy to do that in just some of the accessories. And I picked this because it's an idea of how to accessorize really well. And then if you get sick of that in two or three years time, it's very easy to change. So this is Pantone's color of the year, deep breath here called greenery. So what I did was I found a visual that I thought would show how you could add it into your house in a slightly more subtle way. I'm Cormac Mannion, I'm the Energy Services Manager in Energia and today I'm going to be talking about smart homes and the development of smart homes over the last number of years and how they're going to shape our future in years to come. So for example, the thermostat will link up with your weather station and it'll look at how cold it is outside and it'll tell your thermostat to turn on the boiler if it's a colder morning than normal. So typically you might have your boiler set for 8 o'clock in the morning to turn it on. It's nice and warm when you get up. If it's a colder morning, the weather station will tell the thermostat it's a bit colder than normal thermostat will turn on your boiler maybe half an hour earlier so it's nice and toasty. What a camera might do is the camera might see if there's anyone in the house and it'll turn the boiler off if there isn't anyone there. It'll tell the boiler to turn off. My name is Karen O'Donoghue and I am the community manager with GIY. It's about growing some of your own food, developing food empathy and reconnecting with your food. If you start to have a better awareness of it, a deeper understanding and a better appreciation, suddenly we start to think about other decisions that we're making and we become more conscious consumers. Recycling more, composting more, making sure that we choose green energy makes more sense and so little by slowly we're part of the solution and it's all going to be okay. Uh, you know, today was a great day. We came with three kids because we moved house last week. So the list is endless. We have hundreds of things to do. So it's great to hear Neville talk about the new trends in interiors. My husband got some tips on smart heating and all the gadgets. And then the herbs. It's great to see how to grow it yourself. And we're going to try to do some down the side of our house eventually when we get there. But it's great, great day.